All right. Um.
Okay, yeah, it, it is a bad idea. It was a bad idea, and I realized it was, but it was funny. Ha! 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 
Already? I waited a long time for someone to rescue me. It's my own darn fault. I'm here though. Dropped something down the well and claimed in and after it. Ah. Uh. I even had a ladder, but yeah, it broke when I tried to climb up. Ah. Uh. Then on top of that, my best buddy I go everywhere with should have noticed, but, uh, he didn't. He kept right on going. Ha! Come on, man, really? Sorry, not your fault. Can't tell you how happy I am that you came down here. But, what now? The ladder's wrecked. Ah. Uh. I mean, the broken part is still here, so we technically could fix it if the dang ladder wasn't so high to reach.
it's just you and me now, stuck down at the bottom of the well. Not the worst place to call home, I guess. Ah! Huh? Wait. It's fixed? Did you do that? You're incredible. Now, let's get let's get out of here already. <laughs> Man, you saved me. I thought I'd be stuck in there well for the rest of my life. Seriously. I really owe you. So here, take this. Not bad. Ah. I'm going to catch up to my buddy Jora and head to Foothill Stable so we can apply for the Zonai Survey, ah. survey Team. See you around. Thanks again. And hey, don't go falling into any wells, okay? cave fish. A luminescent fish that lives in dark caves. When consumed, its light enzyme can make one's body glow.
Why does that thing hit so hard? Oh boy. I realize I should have expected that, but I forgot. A Zonai device for a timed explosion. It blasts. Its blast can uh, activate other Zonai devices. Huh. Interesting. Yeah. Oh. Huh? 
Princess Zelda sent you went under the castle to investigate the gloom. And that's when the castle rose into the air. Everyone's been wor so worried about about both of you. Pura has barely slept. She's been trying to figure out where you two went. Ah. At the moment, Pura should be in that building with the telescope. Please hurry there now. She want to know that you're all right. Ha! Ha! All right. Look out, Wayne. Oh. <laughs> of stir hmm? <laughs> oh ho but you probably needed something didn't you well if this is your first visit go talk to that soldier in the center of our fort This group's going to join the search for Princess Zelda. So whatever you need, it got to wait until... Mm -hmm. What? Is that really you, Link? You've returned? I've got to say that it's a relief to see that you're safe. I'm Gralin's head of the Monster Control crew. But we can talk more later. You need to report in to Pura immediately. She has to know you're back. Oh. You'll find Pura in that main building over there. Hurry, please.
That hair. That hair. Those eyes. The the doc. Oh. Doctor Pura. The swordsman. The swordsman has returned. Now where have you been? Linky, you're not a ghost, are you? Hey. That looks interesting. Phew. One step at a time. What exactly happened? Head of the lookout landing. So when you and Princess Zelda go beneath Hyrule Castle, you discover a mysterious mummy, which suddenly reanimates. Then, Zelda falls into a fissure and vanishes. That must have been when the castle rose and the ruins fell. Then, later, you wake up on a sky island, saved by the arm that was stuck to the mummy. You get the Pura Pad from an unusual creature and learn that your new arm belonged to someone named Rauru. The Master Sword disappears. You hear the princess's voice and find your way here. What? Ben? What? Are you saying you came from up there? This Rahu you met. I think that's what the first king of Hyrule was called. Hmm. Are they one and the same? So much of this doesn't make sense yet. But I'm certain that money you found under the castle must be related to the upheaval. Hmm. The castle rising up, the runes falling down from the sky. The mummy must be connected to it somehow. Ah. And then, there's the most important detail of all. You're sure that you heard the princess speak to you? And she gave you a clear message to find her? If that truly was the princess, then that means she's alive. Maybe she's trapped beneath the castle and needs help. Mm -hmm. That settles it, Link. I know you only just returned, but I need you to meet with the, the search party up by Hyrule Castle. They've been searching tirelessly for you too. The captain in charge of the search is named Hose. Work with him to find the princess as quickly as you can. Yes. I know that mummy must still be lurking somewhere around there. Which is concerning, to say the least, but... We have more immediate problems to deal with right now. I'm counting on you, Linky. <laughs> Ooh, cool. Huh? 
What do you think you're doing? Ow. Joseph needs that for her chasm research. Don't touch any of it without her permission. Oh, get in big trouble if you do. Hey, hey, you, do you have any idea how worried we've been? Robbie. Oh. So, that's the arm, huh? I overheard Pura talking about it. Hmm, I see. Yeah, it's kind of weird. But, alright. Hmm. Nope. Now is not the time for distractions. That's got to wait until later. Anyway, I heard you got yourself the Pura Pad now. Ah. You know that Pura Pad of yours can get a lot more powerful. I know it's real potential. I've got big plans for that device, but first, I need to help Josa with her investigations into the depths. But then, oh yes, then I will head back to the lab in Hateno Village to resume my research. <laughs> so, once I'm able to finish up here, you should join me there. <laughs> this will prove, prove more comfortable than I expected. Not too hot, not too cold. Cozy, really, for a while. I had no need for heat resistant chili ingredients or cold resistant warm ones. I cooked for pleasure instead of survival. For a time, I considered tilling the soil in here, living off the land until the end of my days, but times have changed. The people formed a myriad of new caves. Consider my curiosity peaked. Unexplored lands are a veritable buffet of cooking materials, and I, Aruni Tamu, intend to dig in. If you seek fortune, keep moving. Chef Aruni Tamu, Master of Cuisine. Energizing fried green. Mm.
All right, we'll end it there for now, and I'll see you guys later.